All right, quick video today. We're gonna modify one of our bus bars kits so we can make smaller batteries. These are the bus bars we make for the headway cells, right? So we have three sizes. We have a 64 amp hour, we have an 80 amp hour, and we have a 96 amp hour. Now there's uh, several customers that have asked for different sizes. Uh, one uh, customer's asking or say, yeah, they need a 48 uh, amp hour one because of size limitations, right? So 48 would be one, two, three, four, five, six. So it would be half of this battery, essentially. This battery, but in half. Now, we definitely can make that. It's easy for us to, to make these, and depending on the amount of uh, interest that there is, right? Well, we can make those. But because this is DIY, I'm gonna show you right now how you can make that battery size you want. And in fact, you might, because of size constraints, you might have something that, like, you know, seven cells or three cells. We have another customer who wants to put a battery for his audio system on his Harley. And he gave me the dimensions and those dimensions only allow for three sets of cells, right? So we're gonna cut this one right here and then uh, make that battery and then, you know, he could use it. Like, um, this is the cool thing about these that are DIY, you can, you, can, you can make whatever you need, you know, it's the custom size. So I'm gonna show you how to do it right now with this one right here. Okay, so this is the 80 amp hour kit that you get like this. This one doesn't have the, the blocks, two American wire gauge uh, blocks that you can put terminals in there, right? So what you're gonna do is you just take these screws off. These screws are here just to hold this, because it's a double layer, so it can transfer better power at the, at the edges on both of the positive and the negative side, right? So we start by taking these bolts out. You're gonna need one of these big sheer scissors these are cut made to cut the sheet metal and stuff right so what we're gonna do is gonna let's cut six right here and you cut right in the middle Boom. now you do this with the top and you're gonna have to do it with the bottom also oh we'll cut these also and now this is a 48 amp hour one so because I want these here, I'm gonna cut it on this side. Okay, now that you have your bus bars, the 48 uh, amp hour and then the 24 amp hour, it's time to put your cells on here. So we're gonna build this one with these 12 cells here. So there you go. This is now a 24 amp hour uh, 12 volt battery, right? It's, this one's capable of doing like 700 amps, I think, 800 amps. Each one of these strings will do 300 on a dead short. So three, six, eight, nine. Yeah, so 900 on a dead short, but probably 800, 700, I think, you know, within reason. Um, very, very powerful little battery. Uh, so if you want, if you have constraints, size constraints, these are very easily uh, modifiable, right? You just, you just you cut them to size. If you just need one more, you know, two inches more, you'd fit your battery there, you know? So the only thing is you can only cut them this way. You can't cut it this way because then that's three cells instead of four. So then now you're messing with your voltage. But as far as that way, you can uh, make a bunch of, by the way, you could also make two smaller batteries and then connect them in parallel. And it's like building one big one. So if you want to put half your battery on one side of the car or half the other on the other side, then that's totally doable. So there you go. Just a quick video. I think I'm going to send this to a customer that wants to uh, put this on a Harley. He wants a little battery that can do quite a bit of power. 
and he has these uh, constraints, size constraints. So I'm like, okay, maybe this is what is gonna work for you and we'll see how it goes. All right, thank you for watching this video. The links to buy all this stuff, it's on the uh, description of this video. And so we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.